the history of extra oral imaging at Titan Sir Dental, um, we've been through a number of systems. Um, got into CEREC really early, um, really at the beginning of my practice, and loved the technology, loved the capabilities that it could do. And at the time, we were uh, placing implants doing endo, and we knew we had to have a comb beam. Um, in fact, um, we got into a comb beam that wasn't dense by Serona, but once we saw that the functionalities and the way you can integrate things uh, just all made sense, it, it really pushed me towards wanting to get a dense by Serona comb beam so that they could all sing and talk together. And that's what led us to buy, purchase the Orthophos. So what really excites me about the future of this technology is as things have gotten better and better, um, especially in a company like Dense Supply Serona, the way that things are able to now blend together. Um, before, as things were coming out, uh, they would come out in kind of separate packages. You'd have a scanner come out here or a comb beam come out here. But now that things are kind of, they're seeing the power of a, I call it an ecosystem. Um, it's the ability for them to work synergistically and I can see that the future of this technology is very bright. One of our core values at Titan Sir Dental is to always stay up to the most modern and most up-to-date technology because it's really taken dentistry out of the dark ages and into uh, a time where one, it's, it's safer, it's more accurate, it's um, better overall experience for the patient and um, better experience for the dentist too and, and more fun. So as we're getting into you know, using 3D scans on our patients, something that really surprised me was how much, um, unfortunately, how much treatment we were missing. Um, a lot of times periapical infections uh, just wouldn't show up on a two-dimensional PA or two-dimensional two, two image. And unfortunately, I think we're missing that. Uh, with the, having this 3D uh, comb beam, um, it's really opened our eyes and, and to treatment plan our patients more fully. So I can remember a particular case um, that's, that just shows you the power of this technology. Um, had a good patient, a uh, good family who ended up moving out of state, um, but they appreciated our technology. They appreciated appreciated the dentistry that we provided and this this patient needed an implant um, however you know being out of state and other situations it can take multiple appointments it can be a long drawn out process uh, however with the integration with the prime scan and the ortho orthophos and being able to 3d print surgical guides I was able to have him fly in uh, we got all the information we were able to place do a same day implant uh, where we were able to place his implant and also scan for the final impression. So that way, uh, in three months time, when that implant was fully integrated, he was able to take another trip in town and we had the final restoration all ready to go. And so in just two quick appointments, he was able to get an implant and to get that final restoration. And um, honestly, that's, that's probably production I would have never have seen otherwise. If uh, we didn't have the technology, it's something that, you know, that patient had, uh, really appreciated and he sought after. And um, that just, that really hit me uh, showing, wow, this, this stuff is powerful. So there were a number of reasons I selected the Densply Serona Orthophos. One, uh, being a general dentist, I wanted a machine that could take a 2D pano and also the 3D uh, imaging, the 3D comb beam. So that was really important, uh, which it did. Uh, another thing was the field of view. Um, it actually captures someone's airway uh, to allow uh, the help with the sleep side of the practice as well. And so that helped with patient education. I wanted to make sure we could see the airway and also capture both arches in just one scan to keep it easy. Um, and also real important is to the communication with CEREC. Um, I knew that I could integrate all of the information together uh, by getting this comb beam and that was really important to me. So not only is uh, my orthophos uh, vital in the implant planning process, 
I use it in a number of different ways as well. Uh, one is endo. Um, so it's really great to go into, uh, let's say, a first upper molar um, endo surgery and know that there's an MB2. Uh, it's, it's so, so important, such good vital information. I, I tell you the one thing, um, since integrating this technology, it's completely transformed our dental practice um, into just this real state-of-the-art, high-end practice that people come to because they know that we do have the best and most up-to-date technology. We have referrals from all over uh, that come for that specific reason. People care about that now. It's been able to advance our dentistry um, into other areas such as implants um, and more complex surgeries. It's helped with our diagnosing. And um, of course, as a, a business owner, it has increased our production um, tenfold. Um, you're diagnosing more, your treatment case acceptance is higher, um, you're practicing more fun dentistry. It's just all around just been such a great um, decision and uh, I could never now practice without. This technology is 